Ladies and gentlemen, from the Laker Hall to the UC, on each Wednesday of every week, we're putting you on the spot with whatever questions we've got. From fashion to politics, you get it all on campus, Candice. And now, for today's hosts, Clarence and Timmy. Hi, I'm Timmy. And I'm Clarence. Welcome to the Halloween edition of Campus Campus. <laughs> Ultimate Viking fan. And what about you? I'm an Empress. Okay, so Miss Empress, tell us, which one would you rather prefer? The trick or the treat? You know, I can't make up my mind, but I'm gonna let them tell us what they want. Uh, the treat? Because I'm green here. I like spice. So. Treat. I don't like tricks. Uh, I'll take a trick. Trick of the treat depends on what the trick was. I mean, are we turning tricks or am I gonna get a nice treat? <laughs> treat? Like candy. Who doesn't like candy around here? That's when I was younger? Yeah. Okay, the treat. You gotta go for the candy. You gotta go for the candy? Yeah, now what that I'm older, I might want the trick. <laughs> Wonder what kind of tricks he's talking about turning. I don't know either. Well, tell me, which one would you rather prefer? The haunted house or the Halloween party? I want a haunted house party. I want a little bit of both. That's cheap. You can't do that. Yeah, you anyway, can. Anyway, let's see what they have to say. Halloween party. Because I like to party. <laughs> Haunted house. Because I've always been interested in mysterious. Haunted house. Because it's, it's, it serves the purpose of Halloween. It's kind of it's laughable that way when you get scared or whatever. Plus, I like a lot of Halloween movies and whatever. I'd say a Halloween party would be better. Okay. Costume party. Halloween party. Because I'm always the life of the party. We gotta have something going on. I don't wanna be running around in no haunted house. Get a, get a party going on. We can get a, come around here one time. Well, Timmy, I guess you're right. They do want the haunted house party. Women are always right. We already know what we're wearing, and you guys already see what we're wearing, but what are you wearing to Halloween parties? You think about either do uh, a Superman costume or a spot? What I wear? Usually you can't afford a costume, so I put a slept sticker on with God on it. That's my costume. I'm a Tinkerbell. I love Tinkerbell. <laughs> I was Dr. Seuss one year, and I really love that costume. Oh, Clarence, maybe you can uh, give Superman your little cape. I like Superman. Now watch me, you fly through the sky with a purple cape. Yeah. Anyways, oh. what's the weirdest treat you ever got? I mean, I don't know. Um, uh, what I got? What about you? I know. I know what I got. I got salad. This lady was giving little kids salads. Oh man, talk about having a healthy Halloween. <laughs> I don't think so. What's the weirdest treat you guys got? Ranch and cheese. Go away. I don't know. I really don't know. Weirdest? Weirdest treat? <laughs> Nothing? Yeah. Um, a bag of potato chips. Oh, it's 17. Come down there, you know, it was like he ran out of candy. So I was like, okay, give me something. He ran out two beer bottles. I was like, I'll take it. So, yeah, it was gone. Oh, I mean, I'm not gonna tell what I'm gonna do with that beer bottle, but I went. With no razor blades. That's a good Halloween trick that psychopaths like to use. I have forgotten who was. Oh, um. Collard green flavored candy. Yeah. Wow. I remember that like it was yesterday. Yeah. October 31st, 1992. I was 12 years old. Yeah, that was not good. If I see you, it's on. Yeah. A bag of chips? Really? Yeah, what's wrong with a bag of chips? You heard what he said. A bag of chips. At least it's not a salad. Thank you for joining us in this episode of Captain's Candid. See you next time. I guess they're the haunted house party.